we're entering graduation season. And with that, a note here about that classic commencement speech message. When you reach, yes, reach for the stars. And yes, when you fall, fall forward. But after a couple of solid decades now of reaching and falling and reaching again, I can safely say it's one thing to urge people to go big, it's another to do it. First, let me say this, going big, not for everyone. I have some friends who early on realized that a chill life was more them. They don't have a big title to their name, but they live comfortably and they have plenty of what a lot of successful folk try to buy, time. The takeaway here, if you're about to start adulting, try to reflect on what you want. Okay, but let's say going big is the goal. If someone gets us focusing on that end point way out in the distance, we may not realize what lies a mile ahead or a block or a step, and that could leave us unprepared. Unprepared for what, you might ask? Life. Life is filled with a lot. A lot of temptations and loves and losses and bills and sicknesses and letdowns and loneliness. And yes, amazements. And of course now, social media expectations. A lot. And it all fills that path between here and there. And to pass through each one of those moments and stay on course often requires its own mix of sacrifice and endurance. I mean, we could be talking about dozens of decisions a day where you say, I'm going to choose to take one more step forward towards that big goal. And let's be honest, we don't always take that step, which means we have to take two the next time to make up the distance. Or we don't, and we fall behind or stop altogether. My point here is that success can be found in every decision from the large to the teeny tiny. And the only advice I can offer to help with this is to start developing habits. Like brushing your teeth. You don't even really think about it, you just do it, which removes some of the motivation you might otherwise need to get it done. Now, if you develop those habits for other aspects of life, then taking those steps forward becomes easier. The challenge then becomes sticking by those habits you've worked so hard to form and I'm still working on that one. So, not the most lofty of graduation messages, but one I kind of wish I heard. See you on Monday.